Hello guys, welcome to online web tutor. I am Sanjay. We are learning e-commerce theme development tutorial. This is our part number 30. Inside this video session guys, we are going to continue about modification of single-product.php and this is the second video of that. Now if I back to its front end, so here inside this, as we can see that for this image, we have no zoom effect. So by default, WordPress provides a theme support to provide the zoom effect on inside this product thumbnail image. Also, if we go back, let's click on this second pagination. Inside here, as we can see that we have logo collection, click on few products. And inside this, here we have appearing more products inside this. So if we click on any of that, this is simply opening all about the image URL. So WordPress by default provides a theme support which is going to give a like a slider effect as well as a zoom effect into this product thumbnail image. So what I will do if I back to editor, now go to functions.php and as we know that inside this file we have added all about WooCommerce theme support. So inside this we are going to add some let's say product support. So product let's say thumbnail effect support so what I will do we are going to use the same function of WordPress called add theme support and inside this we are going to pass let's say WC which it stands for WooCommerce here we have product gallery hyphen let's say zoom here now if we save this change also Again, we need to use called add theme support. Inside this, we're going to use WC product gallery and let's say light box. Also, we want all about product slider. So let's add theme support. Here we will have called WooCommerce hyphen product underscore sorry hyphen gallery and here we will have called slider so these are the supports we have added for our product thumbnail so if we save this change back to browser we reload this page and as we can see that when we go inside this post thumbnail we have now a zoom effect as well as if I scroll down go inside this products list if we click on any of the product as we can see that now we are getting a slider effect inside this thumbnail image this is the image when we click on that here we are getting another zoom effect over this product this is all about adding post thumbnail theme support these effects is going to work for all the products what we have inside our product list back to the list now when we click on this let's say that this is long sleeve T when we go over and as we can see that we have a zoom effect so this is all about guys we have the theme supports inside this product thumbnail this is a quite easy and handy like plugin what the WooCommerce provided as a theme support to go with the product thumbnail so in the next video, we will see that how can we understand about this single hyphen product.php, how it works, how it is going to add this like the layout, where it is going to find and create the layout something like this. If suppose we want to customize the HTML of this title, of this course cost, of this add to cart button, of this category, as well as if we want to work over these tabs, so how can we work on that? We will find all about the HTML of this single hyphen product.php in the next video. So inside this video session, guys, if you went out, then please drop your comment. I will give my reply as soon as possible. So for this video session, guys, thank you for watching and have a great day.